Okay, that was that's that's just a gross misrepresentation. <laughs> uh, I don't really know what I want. Uh, I just kind of want to date around, fart some more during. Damn, this got a lot of rocks. <laughs> but why do you have so many rocks? What's the kinkiest thing you've ever done? I'm very into the kink community, so okay, tying people up, clamps, peeing on people. Would you ever be into someone peeing on you? I think I'm going to have to say no. Whether she says no or not, my answer is a resounding no. I can understand to a certain degree the certain fetishes, but that one is a little much. Hi. My name's Gabriel. Hi. Hi. Good to meet you. You too. Fun fact about Gabriel. Sometimes he farts during sex. Okay, that was that's that's just a gross misrepresentation. L listen, listen, bro. Everybody does it. It's all good, man. You don't have to get upset. I mean, I don't know why she started busting out laughing either. I mean, hell, everybody does it. Quit trying to be pissed off about the whole situation, Gabriel. Just, just take it. Just take it like a man. You fart during sex. Not regularly. The time. Not I regularly. Uh -huh. I was very. I was terribly nervous. Okay. And I just farted out of nervousness, and you know. She laughed. What, what, what is this? What, like, I, I've never understood this. Oh, you know, I was just, I, I was so nervous and, um, uh, it, it just came out and, uh, my dog stepped on a bee and my dog stepped on a bee. It was, yeah, it was just very much over at that point. I mean, oh. there's really no coming back from that. Oh. I don't think there was a lot of that. What are you two looking for in a relationship right now? <sighs> I mean, I, I was like monogamous for a long time and now I'm not. I'm just kind of enjoying being single and dating around, to be honest with you. What about you? Mm. Then, pre um, then press the button. I have my answer, but I, I, I can't do the dating around. I see. How are you doing? Yeah, you're, you're looking for something stable. It's fine, girl. We, we all understand it. Like, it's all good. No worries. Uh, I don't really know what I want. Uh, I just kind of want to date around. Fart some more during sex. Maybe poop a little. Good, how are you? I'm good. What are your red flags? I can get pretty hot headed. Okay. Um, when I'm okay. mad, I don't want to talk. I feel like that's more mature than trying to like be heated in the yeah. moment. For me, probably that I make everything into a joke. Like I do stand up. What's your best joke right now? It better be funny. I have Honestly, I'm kind of that same way too. Like if there's a really like serious situation or if it's something that, you know, doesn't really warrant like anyone to be really cheerful or happy in the moment, I do have those moments where it's just like, I try to make a joke out of it because I, I don't see a reason for people to just sit there and be upset. I, I mean, I understand if it's a certain moment that's, you know, needing for seriousness, then yeah, of course, I'll read the room and I won't say anything. But certain things, it's just like, okay, come on, I know you're upset, but hey, look, look, we're gonna go do something. I'm gonna be stupid, probably hurt myself at this point. I don't know. But hey, you, you'll never know until you stop crying and we go and figure it out. By the way, I'm a glasses dude now. Um, my eyeballs hurt, so I had to get some glasses. I keep forgetting to wear them, but I remembered them this time. I have a joke about uh, how collecting lovers is like collecting rocks. Like, you can never have too many. If you bring a certain number back through your apartment, like, your leasing agent is going to start looking at you kind of funny. Like, damn, this bitch got a lot of rocks. <laughs> Why do you have so many rocks? Stupid. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry. Can I ask why? You're not my type. What's your type? Bigger women. No hard feelings. <laughs> I got a plywood for your body. Damn, I'm fat as hell and that, that hurt me. Lonnie, I'm Sid. What kind of music you're into? Oh, Everything here we go, except Sid. for Screamo. I'm more of like into like dark wave, kind of like, what's dark wave? So it's like sexy dungeon, like club music. <laughs> sexy dungeon club music. I've never heard of that music before. Sexy dungeon club music. Oh my God, whole oh, BDSM playlist? No, no, that's very, Jesus Christ, what the hell did I just find? Why is this shit on YouTube? Uncensored music, 
What? Now I'm in the game, I was on the bench. On the bench. First I was renting, now I'm collecting rent. Run it up. First it with the beamer, now I want the bands. Spending all the back like here I go again. Go again. Outside says the chirp, now the camera phone. Told you I'ma make, keep the channels on. Yeah. Why you acting different when the camera's Why on? Why you acting different like your paper long? Eight day wake up and, and I thank God. Bad decision got you wishing you, you could say nah. I say the gritty, you could get hit any day now. Nah. Oh my mama, I'ma move off any way out. What? I didn't even know that was a. Th How is that even allowed on YouTube? Wow. <laughs> <laughs> How do YouTube handle pain? Piercings and tattoos don't hurt for me. I have my nipples. My nipples didn't even hurt. It hurt after. It hurt after, hurt. yeah. I just recently got one of my nipple rings ripped out, and that hurt. <laughs> Damn. Do you have no nipple? No, I have a nipple. It oh, just okay. like kind of has like a little split in the center of it. Oh. See, I don't know if I would ever want to get those kinds of piercings. Like, the, I think that is probably what would keep me from getting those piercings. Cause, goddamn, that sounds painful. I mean, I've had an ear piercing and I've had an eyebrow piercing, but none of those seem as painful as the nipple. Like that shit f***ing hurts. On the door and it just ripped it right out. Anyway. Are you two vibing with each other? I am, but I don't think it's going any further. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Elani. Tattoo says queen, huh? I am a queen. Uh -oh. I'm also divorced. Interesting. Yes. Oh. What's the kinkiest? Uh oh. Uh oh, they, they were from the beginning, so they, they, they must be really hitting it off. The, uh, otherwise, they wouldn't have even been featured. Like, it, come on, Cut wouldn't put them in the beginning unless something good happens. Thing you've ever done. Probably be like tied up with rope or like handcuffs. I'm very into the king community, so. Okay. Tying people up, clamps, peeing on people. Okay. Oh, uh, come on, come on, Elizabeth, say something. You you know that that would, that would make you so happy if she did that. Would you ever be into someone peeing on you? Come on, come on, say yes. Definitely not. <laughs> oh, come on. Ugh, she's f***ing lying. It was especially crazy. <laughs> I really like this tattoo you have. Can you tell me about that? Is it... Oh, I didn't realize it went red. She was really into her, but uh, apparently the feeling wasn't mutual. Bye bye I think you're just a little too shy for me. You'd be surprised once you get to know me. You shouldn't have said no to pee. Yeah. You should have said no to pee. You'd be very surprised. Where does Cut find these people? Like, how do you audition these people? Like, okay, so today we're going to be doing uh, a video called uh, Kinky Singles Tried to Find Love. Um, so uh, what's your talent? I'm really into baking, oh, um, which yeah. is hilarious because I don't actually like sweets that much. No, I feel the same way because sometimes I like try to pawn it off to my roommates. So, so do you, you still live with roommates then? I still live with roommates. Are you looking forward to having a place of your own? Um, I probably will stick with having roommates. You I, like roommates. I go a little crazy if I'm alone. But. I mean, I, I get it. It is good to have your own place and not always have to rely on roommates. I'm not saying that it's a bad thing. I mean, I have roommates. I think that it's fine, roommates or not. But if you were going to get with her, wouldn't you have just like been her permanent roommate? I'm confused. I feel like such a bitch. Like, no, why? <laughs> Why do you feel like a bitch? Just, you have preferences. Oh my God. Uh, listen, I'm just making fun of you a little bit. That's all. I'm, I'm not meaning anything bad about it, okay? Listen, listen. I have no problem with your kink of pee, okay? Hi, I'm Reno. Hi, Reno. Fun fact about Reno. Reno. They like to step on their partners. Oh yeah, that's fun. You seem like also... I, I mean, I guess it's not the worst kink. Like, I thought they were going to say, like, something out of the ordinary. Like, oh, they think everybody is their step sister or something what are you doing step ladder are you stuck i'll help you out of there like step on their partner i mean it's still weird but not as weird as what i thought like i was really prepared for something much weirder kinky person is that a correct <laughs> read i am well, that is a big part of my life but like i'm also interested in other things what are you passionate about i've kind of always wanted to be like a smoky jazz lounge singer <laughs> Ooh. can we hear you sing a little Gloomy is Sunday, with shadows I spend it all. My heart and I have 
decided to end it all. That was beautiful. I hope my claps are going through the microphone. Otherwise, that would just be embarrassing. I have pillow hands. Raymond, are you attracted to Sid? Button, I don't know. Attraction's hard. <laughs> it's okay. I want to be your friend. Oh, really bad. <laughs> You're so fucking Hit the cool. button. Okay. <laughs> do you smoke weed a lot? No. Okay. No. Okay. Okay. Like, I'll do edibles. <laughs> I hope you find who you're looking for. You too. But wait, what? what's going on on their teeth? <laughs> Do you like EDM? This is so... Hey, it's her again. What is going on with your teeth? what is it that diamond thing that people get on their two front teeth why do people do that i don't i don't get that it, i'm sorry i don't care who you are it looks stupid yeah. okay i hate it okay <laughs> i hate okay. it so much i mean it's not my favorite type of music but i can dance to it you're not one of those people that only listens to EDM. no no no, no, no. <laughs> okay i dare you to hold hands look at each other don't say a word for 20 seconds oh you have nice hands clock is starting It's it's a no. It's a no. It is a no. How Good. Very vulnerable, but nice. Very vulnerable. Yeah. I know. I it's am a no. not a person it's a no. with autism, but like mm -hmm. I've dated a lot of people with autism, okay. so it's really comforting to hear that, actually. Yeah. I think that somebody looking to date me should be aware of like my past and like yeah. what I've gone through. I mean, I have been in recovery for like multiple reasons and I'm, I'm doing really well now. I was dealing oh, good. with a pretty severe eating disorder. Um, that I was in recovery for about six months. And there are some other issues too that I've been dealing with, just drugs and not being nice to myself. And I don't know, it can be a lot for someone to handle. I, I mean, congratulations. First of all, I was never diagnosed with an they're they're still going holy shit eating disorder but definitely have experienced some disordered eating so that's not something that is like scary to me okay yeah that's good. Really good to hear describe the energy you both are feeling right now are they actually going to say yes is this the first button that i'm going to see in so goddamn long that someone's actually going to say yes listen if you press this button whenever the button stops talking i will find you but I feel like I'm able to be open with you yeah. and that you won't be too freaked out by anything that I'm about to say. What about you? I'm shaky. <laughs> me too, <laughs> me too. Fuck, yeah. literally. <laughs> Do you see this? Yeah. So I'm gonna light up one more time. If you don't press me, I'm gonna consider it a match. Oh, come on. There she come goes. On. Come on, come on, come on. <laughs> <laughs> Turn off, bitch. Well done. Finally. Yay. Whoa. Oh my God. It is about time. Someone finally found love on there. Congratulations, cut. I was about to give up. Jesus Christ, someone said yes. <laughs>